everyone welcome to study time in this video we are going to see class 4 uh, evs chapter 25 spicy riddles this is an interesting chapter so we'll see what is given in this chapter so we are going to see more about spices that we use in our uh, indian kitchen so here is a riddle we'll find out i can be powdered fine so this is a spice I can be powdered fine to make food hot and spicy. If too much of me is added, I make you gasp, she she. Your eyes and nose begin to water and you cry. Think and tell me whom am I? Tell me quickly whom am I? So this is you. You would have found this from this picture itself. It is chili or mirchi. Grind me and powder me. So this is yellow colored. grind me and powder me to make your food look yellow i am mixed in oil by granny and applied to wounds quickly i heal all wounds big and small that is why i am loved by all think and tell me uh, who am i tell me quickly who am i so it is yellow colored so easy it is turmeric that is haldi so from this picture you can you uh, everyone guess what it is small and round like a pearl i am black when i am whole i can be powdered coarse or fine a sharp and spicy taste is mine whether it is salty or sweet i am added as a special treat think and tell me whom am i who am i tell me quickly who am i so it is easy pepper i am a small and skinny chap sometimes i am brown and sometimes black added to hot oil and ghee i spread my fragrance all around me when i am roasted curd and jaljeera are favorite to me think and tell me who am i tell me quickly who who am i so it is easy is it cumin or jeera so i look like zeera do green am i to make your stomach healthy i always try eat me always after your meal i refresh your mouth you surely surely feel think and tell me who am i tell me quickly who am i so is it is easy fennel fennel seeds are green in color like jeera i look like a nail but a bud i am so I look like a nail but a bud am I chocolate brown in color and a strong smell have I when your toothache makes you shout i soothe the pain in your mouth think and tell me who am i tell me quickly who am i so it is close now try and make your own riddles about two other spices as those riddles in the class draw pictures of the two spices in your notebook and write their names so first one is i am the costliest spice in the world i spread my fragrance uh, far and wide i love exotic uh, dishes like biryani i give yellow color to the dish i look like a fine hair tell me who am i so it is saffron so i look like the bark of a tree i come in shape of small sticks i am used in dishes for my fragrance i am also used in chocolates candies and chewing gums i am a chocolatey brown tell me who am i so it is cinnamon find out which spices are used in your house for cooking uh, cooking make a list and look at your friends uh, list too so usually we use a uh, turmeric pepper ginger cumin saffron so you can compare with your friends list when your grandparents wearing which spices were used most in their kitchens find out from them and write here so red chili turmeric onion coriander so these were the uh, things were mostly used name one spice which is put into both sweet and salty things cardamom so we use this spice in both sweety and sweet and salty things find out what is put into food to make it uh, taste sour vinegar i am 
Kutan. I live in Kerala. There is a garden of spices in the backyard of my house. There I see plants of tejpata, small and big cardamoms and black pepper grow. Find out whether any spices are grown in your area. Write their names here. So you can write a chilli, turmeric, ginger, garlic or whatever spice it is grown in your place. Bring some whole spices to class. Write their names on the table. Close your eyes and try to recognize each spice by spelling, by smelling and touching each one in turn. Put a right mark in front of the ones you recognize. If you do not recognize, put a wrong mark. So you can... Uh, Bring any uh, spices like clove, chilli. So you have to write the name of the spice. If you found out by smell, you can mark a tick. If you found out uh, by touching, you can mark a tick. So if you have not found, you have to mark wrong. Similarly, you have to fill 2, 3, 4, 5. Next, let us uh, try making a spicy potato chart. So for that, what you need is boiled potatoes. Salt, red chilli powder, mango powder that is amchur or lemon according to your taste. Roasted cumin seeds, black salt and garam masala if it is possible. Fresh coriander seeds. Peel the boiled potatoes and cut them into small pieces. Now add salt, chilli powder, mango powder or lemon juice according to the taste. To make your chat more delicious add a little roasted cumin seeds, black salt and coriander powder a pinch of garam masala can also be added at the end mix the potatoes well sprinkle chopped coriander leaves on top so this is your spicy potato chat which is ready to eat next did you enjoy the potato chat yes just imagine if there were uh, no spices to make the potato chat how would it taste so its taste won't be so good Try to learn and make a different kind of chat and enjoy with all your friends in class. So you can make uh, the same uh, chat with uh, other boiled vegetables or uh, corn, sweet corn. How do or mushroom also you can make the same thing. How do spice less and very uh, spicy things uh, feel on your tongue? Spicy things give a uh, tingling sensation on my tongue spiceless things do not give such sensation so this is all about this chapter this chapter is very interesting so you can make a different chart varieties uh, you have learned how to make a potato chart or uh, you can do the same uh, procedure to make a mushroom chart corn chart or boiled vegetable chart so hope this video is useful and understanding so we'll see in the next video. Thanks for watching.